Well, I'm talking about my mama. Well, what a great way to start. <laughs> 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 Two fates. Fates. Rise of Madness. Same fate, new campaign, new location. Yes, we are in a new location because... For anyone who didn't already uh, notice that. Yeah, <laughs> it's pretty obvious if you're a familiar watcher. Uh, All two of you. Yeah. 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 Very good. Thanks, Miranda. <laughs> yeah. 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 I'll say personalized fan signs coming soon. Thank you, respective girlfriends. <laughs> oh, it doesn't even. It's like she watched it. like did it like for ten minutes total days. ever. That's how like she can at least turn it on for the view. That, that uh, no. No. Oh, okay. Holly's the one that tells us half the time if the sound's broke. <laughs> <laughs> she sticks to the sound's not working. My one, my one co-worker, my one co-worker just lot. tunes in and checks it out every now and again. <coughs> okay, last time. Oh, I need to tell my, my way, group. Camera right here. It's on my, my DM screen, so you get a really nice close-up of my face. Still can't see yeah. his yeah. eyes. Yeah, tell, tell him about his Fudging. nose hairs. Tell him about all the, all the things wrong. It's fine. So uh, don't pick your nose on camera. I'm guessing this is Hogwarts. You're disgusting. Jiff that, or gif that, however you say that word. Who cares? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to jiff you. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds dirty. It's supposed to be. So I'm going to I still prefer jiff. Braves the sewers, <laughs> and after fighting a few wear rats. And a cube. And a drop. G- I mean, the G in Two it cubes. is for graphical. Two cubes. Well, you didn't fight the other cubes, so. technically. You just grabbed the box out Traffic. of the man. That's it's true. Giraffical. <laughs> You are able to retrieve the bomb the in the beige market and successfully disarm it. And if I recall correctly, we ended on a. Uh, that's not working. Oh, yes. Um, this was just like right in the middle. Oh, right. Uh, a couple of quick things. Yahtzee. Um, Eli is away right now. So he will be not playing today, and it's it's not it's nothing crazy. It's his mom's birthday. So happy birthday, Eli's mom. Happy and, birthday, Eli's mom. Uh, Thank you for mm-hmm. tuning in, by the way. Melanie is mom. under the weather, <laughs> so she will not be playing either. That's okay. I have Harriet right here. Just smashy smash, repeat. Yes. Dirty druid. No, no. Ranger, ranger. Ranger, ranger. <laughs> Question, question. Straight into <laughs> All right, now, that one that you just disarmed, to remind you, is the one that has the number two upon it. You took it out, got a little help from the gnome fellow, and <clears throat> it is now, yeah. what's, what's, what's next? I guess is the big uh, question. You do that all the time. <laughs> yeah. It's probably Eli's. Uh, or one of the boxes. What is it? No, I'm missing one of the black one. The one that I'm like, oh, I hate this one. The black D20. Yeah, my black D20. But it's fine. I can just use it in D20. It's yeah. fine. It might be in For here. the night, it's yours. Nice. Hmm? Got it. Black D20? Yep. I have a couple of those. Red, red, red letters. Pretty excited about this. Red letters. Uh, uh, that's yeah, specific. Numbers. It's coming along. <laughs> no, I don't. The letter one. Yeah. Yeah. Straight, on straight on through. I have some old orange ones from the old 3-5 dice sets that they used to sell. Wow. Oh, uh, oh yeah, dude. <laughs> I got dice. Actually, the only thing I really need... I got lots of dice. Actually, I, I don't need literary D6 that I got from a random pound of dice. Man, I am. On the Was it like this one? <clears throat> uh, no, exactly. That's okay. I need more dice. Not really relevant. Well, no, this one the I more, got from a pound of dice a long time ago. Pound of dice are very cool. It's one of more my favorite dice. Purple, dice. Dice. Like purple ones in color. Um, like this? We had a couple like of purple level and swirly ones. Man, I, it was After really hard for me session, to not buy. There was a set of that uh, was it was three of you, right? So it was Finn, Crowley, and Quetzal. All of you leveled up. That's right. No, no, not Quetzal. No. Oh, Quetzal leveled up. Oh, shit. It's so too late. You already no, said no, it. No, no, you already said it. No, 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 no. It's Krishna. <laughs> it's Krishna. It's, it's, That's it's right. been established. That's right. Can't take it back. <laughs> <laughs> now all my weapon attacks are plus one. <laughs> yeah, so we've got... Yeah, Crowley, Finn, and Krishna are all now That's five. Brutal. Everyone else is really close. Um... Kane is the furthest behind, uh, mostly because he missed 
for most sessions. Uh, but I mean, you'll you'll still level up basically with everyone else, uh, just based on the quantity of XP that's theoretically going to happen here. So we did just exit the sewers into the market. You exited the sewers. You um, you got the gnome guy who seems to be basically on call now. Yeah. Uh, He's kind of our bitch. <laughs> I wouldn't go calling him. <laughs> that's, a, that's a bad idea. That's that's a yeah, that's not. He's a biatch. Um, <laughs> and that's still bad. You are. <laughs> He took the so okay, <laughs> and Shadow oh stepped God. away. Shadow stepped away, and you are now. I think you did this in an alley. No, no, we, we were in the sewer when we did it. No, we were in the alley, right? Yeah, because you exited the sewers, and you're like, we just need to find like a secretish place to do this. So you just stepped into an alley, um, and did that. disarmed so a bomb. <laughs> that's where we are now. Um, so we're we're in an alley outside the beige market. Yes. <clears throat> okay, so we had a short rest. To do that. I don't think we did. I'm a full house. So that's what uh, I thought we took one. No, short I've, rest. I've just taken the damage. No, I haven't taken any damage. <laughs> I don't think you did. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. I definitely didn't. Because <laughs> yeah. you guys are getting, 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 getting caught in the I corner. I'm just think like, you do. All right, well, so I'm going that to. That sucks. Later, guys. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, that's my character. He just, he's like, well. Oh, I, I have a. Hmm. I, I'm trying to find the accent because I almost went Scottish. Yeah, again. again. Yeah. <laughs> He's dead. He's gone. Leave him alone. He's alive somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> so Question: I, I, Are I our weapons the... that we left, like they get enchanted and stuff? Day ten. Huh? Day, day 10. ten. We're on day seven. You're on basically the end of the arc. Five. Ah. Hey. Oh, Remember, can day I, six is the party. Can I just sleep for five days? <laughs> I have to do things that I. Uh, I wouldn't recommend that. Yeah, hybrid. It's like on Skyrim. <laughs> He's rest. Yeah, yeah. Wait. Yeah, just. I've got some ability to wait. So before we continue going, I do have a few things that I would like to do. Um. Yeah. Just, louder than normal. I'm trying to tune this. I have to. I have to. There you go. That worked. Get a wipe. For now. All right. So I'd like to see if I can find a vendor of weapons. Okay. Since we're in the market already. That is absolutely something that you can do. Can I, I sell like my I horse? Should, I feel like I should huh? have more money. Can I sell my horse? Sell your horse? <laughs> Did you just get that horse? I can just summon that ghost <laughs> horse now. A ghost war horse, yo. Uh, <laughs> oh, fine speed. That gets my bonuses, yeah. <clears throat> uh, that's that's a permanent thing, too, once yeah, you have it. You can do that. It's an amazing fucking horse, yeah. yeah. It takes like 10 minutes to cast, I think. Yeah. I believe. God damn it! We got the horse. We're going to the sewers. We're on top of this. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna borrow that from you. If that's okay. Indeed. I need to find it. Uh, let's see. It's a Quickly. spell. I'm, I say I'm tabulated quite well. You are. I appreciate that. A horse. A horse. A horse. A horse. A horse. Of course. Of course. Can I sell Clank as a like a sex robot? <laughs> <laughs> to someone. Hard pass. <laughs> Some interested by it. Would you like to buy my sex robots? <laughs> okay. A war horse cost, generally speaking, is so 400 white. No, no, no. The, um, I haven't seen it yet. I, I had a regular horse. You just had a riding horse. Yeah. And it's 75 white. So that is uh, white rock. Just <laughs> clarify that. <laughs> That's our monetary system of dragon escapes. White rock. Uh, and We're obviously the, the, the white is the, is the most valuable. No, the blue is the most valuable. So, I'm sorry, how much white did you say about so, so it? 75. 75 only? Yeah. Okay, never mind. Awesome. Pleasure doing business with you. Well, no, it's worth 75. You can probably get 50. Oh, 50. <laughs> the pleasure doing business with you. I didn't do business you didn't even with use you. The it's not even used, dog. <laughs> Come on. I just bought this thing. We'll say yeah. zero miles. <laughs> two, two, uh, four things for everything. Awesome. Excuse me, take it off the lot. Alright, so I have something <laughs> yeah. to discuss with you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yes. So, with how uh, Travis did his weapon on on Critical Role, mm -hmm. with his, with, you know, he, bo he bonded with a different weapon and it just morphed into his packed weapon. Right. Would I be able to do something similar? I would say yes. Okay, so I need to go find somebody who has a cool sword. Well, um... The most likely place would be Sven's. 
That's okay. what most people go for this. He's got a monopoly, I've noticed. He does. He does, no one's, no but... One's breaking his monopoly not really. It's a, it's a no benevolent thing. monopoly. It is, <laughs> and here's why. He purchases from everyone else. So, like, there, there are blacksmiths, for example, that make swords and spears and hammer and axes and all that fun stuff. And you can go there and get those. And they'll be the same price. Sven <clears throat> has, see, has, like he has so much money, though, that he just buys everything at, like, the regular price and sells it at the regular price because he doesn't have any... He doesn't have any issues with money because he's the god of technology. Okay. No. It's pretty handy having one of those around. <clears throat> Which, honestly, Spence Coffee Shop has been around for easily a decade in like real life in the games I've run in the past. But only very recently have I really understood that he was secretly the god of technology. Yeah. Uh, which is cool. <laughs> and makes a lot of sense considering his workspace. Uh, how much do we have in party funds? So, treasure. We have. I like having my laptop right here too. That's really handy. Because I can look at my notes. Good. Oh, Say it. Uh, we have five gems, which are 50 white draka each, three green draka, and an extra 100 draka. You buy a boat. <laughs> I'm on a boat. Two boats. You <laughs> buy two boats. For me, I have a fleet. I'll be an admiral. You, you could <laughs> actually. Uh, wait. How much do you have? How much boats? <laughs> uh, we have. Uh, five. <laughs> The blue 20, or 250. You have green. We have green. Which are uh, 100 white. Uh, 100 or 1,000. Uh, Abram has oh. red is 10. I had it written. I, I agree with Silver. Silver. <laughs> white is, a, is the equivalent to gold. I had 100 and green. green is the equivalent I wrote it to down somewhere. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and blue is the, the highest one. Blue, blue is the crazy one. Yeah, I think I got it on here. So 10 red is one white. Ten white is one green, and so forth. No, uh, so there's a hundred white. hundred white is one. A thousand green is one blue. That's what it is. So you said we had a hundred white yeah. rocket total. I mean, no, we have, we have it. I have it. Hang on. Five gems. I have it right here. Three green, and then a hundred white, right? Yep. Okay, so six fifty. I need this out anyway because it has no magic okay. items and things. Two fifty for the two fifty total for the gems plus so three hundred. So we have three thousand. Oh. No, uh, wait, the green is green a thousand. Yeah, that's crazy. Let's buy a boat. Why are we on a boat right now? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right now, blue, right. Yeah. blue is one thousand. We need to go to the uh, the yes. coast to do one thousand white. Yeah. Like this absurd money. Yeah, we we have three yeah. green. Though. Sven is one of okay. the few people that actually uh, relatively frequently trades in blue because. Most people have never seen blue scale money, like blue draka. It's just, it's not. Sorry, my bad. It's not, a really it's not that they're cool inherently idea. rare. It's nope. just that you draw? it's a crap ton of money. Uh, you know. I see it. Eat that yogurt. We sell drugs. Very seductive. <clears throat> okay, so what I'm looking for, uh, I'm, uh -huh. gonna go, I'm gonna go to Sven's. Yeah. And uh, who's at the counter? Uh, oh, hello again. This Damn, one is that was rushing. This one is different. <laughs> you can't do it. I can't. You, know, you lost her. They all seem to have the same name. It could just be a title. Or it could be just something it just super be, racist. Something <laughs> weird. It just, they just are all, they all self identify as Kashi. Kashi has where? Cool. I, I have heard this. How cat like is this Kashi? This one is not as cat-ish. Okay. So I'm not as know. afraid. <laughs> <laughs> right. Because so you're a bird person. Because I'm a bird. It's a dirty mud blood. <laughs> My natural enemy. I am looking for a weapon. I'm not even going to try anymore. <laughs> nope. I don't even know what that was like Swedish. <laughs> I'm looking for a weapon. Yeah. <laughs> I can't yeah. even do I can't do yeah. this. Yeah. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's a scoot. All right. So I am looking for. Kashi. There we go. Specifically, I would like a rapier. Kashi. You want a rapier? 
Arabia. <laughs> no. Oh, you still win. Wow. Okay. Well, can I see your selection of weapons? Wavy arrow or wavy wavy there? Yes. Uh, <laughs> and he points. He's like, Don't I owe <coughs> fifty? <laughs> <laughs> and where exactly is that? They're numbered. No. Ah, okay. Um, and it goes for it, it's pretty big shot. You see all kinds of weird shit. So I'm gonna go find aisle fifty. I'm looking specifically for either a rapier of wounding or a rapier of warning. See. Let me consult the book. I do not have. <laughs> um, I've got the Which rarities. Time right to play here. Jenga. The Dungeon Master's Guide. I have the rapier. I've, 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 I've got. I've got the. Uh, oh, oh, that's perfect. Favorite. It's not. It's not tanned though. That's fine. I don't need it to be tanned. I can just. Yeah. The the magic <laughs> item section is pretty substantial. Yeah. It's Once like the middle. It. Yeah. It's the middle. <laughs> How much would it cost for so me to get wounding, the uh, huh? scorpion? Like get over here. Either wounding. <laughs> either wounding or warning. Like I think that'd be cool. Like. I would use it like uh, what a big warning. Thing. Uh, uncommon. You, you need a blacksmith in a metal. Yeah, grab them. Uh, warning. Like, what I can use as a weapon too. To either what pull book is it in? Like a javelin it's in that with book. a rope attached, basically. Yeah. It's weapon of warning. Oh. You got shoot. it. Out of my hand. Out of your hand. Weapon of warning. And the other yeah. one is weapon of wounding. How does the javelin no, the like? No, sword of wounding. <laughs> Nah. How do you bend your elbow so you can It would be sort of like here. <laughs> Think of oh, the old sweet. school I know, like, right? lightsabers that pulled out. That one was more for like party that. benefit. Well, you have uh, <laughs> so long as Harry is with you and Popeye is there, um, so long as Popeye is not surprised, no one within 30 feet of it is surprised because it cries out oh. in poor fashion. <clears throat> but this also gives me advantage on initiative. That's true. Um, I would venture a guess. Is he robbing this place? Is he robbing this place? <laughs> what? Okay. Gun. He has a gun. <laughs> well, he did say something about a rapier. A, a, a rapier of wounding would be like... Crazy expensive. 4,000, yeah. right? So probably not that one. What about a board? Uh, you see the price and you're like, eh, nope. I wonder if I could sneak this out of here. No. <laughs> Is this finished up? <laughs> Fight your way out. I would die. <laughs> Zetman has a Tarask in a bottle. Oh, <laughs> nice. He actually does. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember hearing the tail of it. He killed that Tarask. He did not kill the Tarask. I've been over this. I'm um, pretty <laughs> sure that never happened. I've, I've heard the legend many a times. <laughs> pretty sure that was the I'm best right. usage of the Fates card ever. Yeah. <laughs> Use it now, Tommy! <laughs> well, because everyone else was dead. <laughs> They're all like... That was a good call, I'll tell you. Okay, so the, yeah. uh, the Rapier of Warning... Would only be um, 300 white. Can I talk you down from the 300? I, I mean, we are adventurers. We would do great business with Sven's. We would spread the word of Sven's and even wear logos. Try on our, see, our see, um, <laughs> Sven doesn't really do the whole um, advertisement thing anymore it's with, with energy parties because pretty much everyone does this thing. So that is fair. Uh, but I've spoken with Sven personally, and he did he did grant me a, a giant glass box to dispose of some magical substance. I mean, mm -hmm. we're on did good you, terms. You mean the trade? Did you? Yes. Mm -hmm. We as friends. It was with possibly one of your relatives. You're all named Khajiit, so I'm not, I'm not sure. Whoa. I don't want to... I don't want to... I'm assuming that's a surname. You're saying they're all related? <laughs> Give me a... Persuasion check with disadvantage. Okay, oh. <laughs> that's fair. <laughs> that's fair. I don't want to name drop, but uh, I'm an ascendant of Evander. So. <laughs> no, I don't want that. <laughs> You're a robot. <laughs> beep, boop, boop, beep, boop. <laughs> bleep, bleep for me too. <laughs> is is everyone going? Um, I'll, yeah, I'll be in the shop. No. Two thirteens. So Wait, actually, I want to go somewhere to cook some. Uh, that's plus eight. <clears throat> Twenty one. With disadvantage. I'll, pro I'll probably ask for uh, go down to a Oh, I need to buy some motherfucking spears. I would accept 250. 
I hand him the card. I will get the card for you. you when later, it's me. But yeah. So two hundred fifty. Oh no, I, I got it from my personal stores. Okay. I just yeah. I wanted to check how much yeah. we had in case I had. Yeah, I'm gonna go somewhere and cook some pies. Okay. How much did you say it cost for the basic pies again? One gold. Sweet. What? Tweaked it. One white. One white. Right. One white. One white. It's really hard to remember that, yeah. <laughs> See, we're going to be using that interchangeably, except for the green and blue Draco, because they're worth more. Well, no, technically the green are essentially platinum. But I don't, I don't really get why the platinums are only like 10 bucks. I'm going to make it more so you can carry more money on your purse someday. Yeah. So, okay. Yeah. So uh, I would also like hair, to sell you my, uh, carry uh, around bins. my charlatan's die. Would you like this? I mean, I can maybe get 50. Uh, I mean, okay. Tell me you roll over for it. <laughs> no. Roll <laughs> for it. <laughs> it is a magical item. I just figured you might want to buy it. Uh, okay. <laughs> That's, right, so that's just a common magic item, right? Yeah. Yeah. He's, 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 he kind of like points right below the counter, and there's like a. a <laughs> like a grab box? Like a basket full of them. <laughs> yeah. All with sixes facing up. Right. <laughs> we have great men. I see that. Okay. But you have a great day. Because you have anyone else? Oh, also. Uh, if you can contact Sven at some point and tell him we may need the glass box back for a few minutes. I can send messages. Thank you. We'll be staying at the Carly's Dream Bazaar. Okay. Sven knows what to find. I'm sure he does. Well, yeah. I thank the shoes. Yeah. And uh, you're back out outside of Sven's shop in the beige market. Uh, I left. I don't know about the rest of them. Yeah, I need uh, 10 spears and a healing potion. Okay. Uh, healing potion is 50 white. And spears, I think, are relatively cheap. Healing potions yeah, are overpriced. One white piece. Well, I have no affordable health care. Ha ha ha! It's healing that doesn't require... A caster? <laughs> yeah, you can stock up on this one. I probably will. Dude, you just want one? Yeah, for now. I'll, okay. probably, I'll probably buy more in the future. You got it. I'm going to join the party back after I'm done cooking. Ten yeah. spears, you say. That's right. Got spears but now, y'all. Let me see what that is, my friend. It's one bolt. One. Oh. He's one. got the page open. Throwing yeah. spears. Yeah. Javelins. <clears throat> Javelins? Well, uh, actually... Well, I guess it could be a javelin or a spear. Well, are you looking to throw them or are you looking to poke, poke with them? You want to poke? You want to throw them? Oh, he's buying ten. He's I want to throw. throw. Yeah, that's so a javelin. Javelins, yeah. <laughs> just bundle all you, ten you spears. Can't <laughs> as far. <laughs> you don't throw spears. You well, you can, them. but yeah, it doesn't. The range isn't as good. Good call, good call though. Okay, hang on. I'm, I'm also a javelin thrower. I'm just away for my messy, my axe and dog wrap. Yeah, I'm not buying anything else other than. I just want to increase my damage die from 1d6 to 1d8. That was the right. whole thing. I could. What's advantage oh, on Can I do something to give myself more armor? Ooh, better AC? No. Well, I health. am working on that. Actually, something that gives me more health, so I'm not like. I'm actually working on a series of artifice upgrades that you uh, can purchase. Well, then I will. Dude, you should check into my... the old Warforged stuff. I might. As like a means of. Increasing. I have a few specific ideas. Um, the I beams are one, which is so. Just to remind you, art <clears throat> an artifice doesn't have an actual articulated face. It's a rune <clears throat> of the creator. Yeah, so, we know. Like it, it's got Effender's rune on the front, and when you speak, it looks like a bite, doesn't it? it? <laughs> when you speak, it it, it flickers, <laughs> like like uh, a lot of sci-fi type robot things. Um, but an upgrade that I think you'll, I'm going to have you kind of start with is a common one, which is the rune beam where you can actually have, have, have the rune shine out with a beam of light, like a 
like a headlight. Um, there's going to be many. I have an idea for one that will be legendary-ish, which is a jetpack, which basically gives you a fly speed. Uh, I like which that. Is pretty rad. Yeah. <laughs> and it's legendary because, well, it's a jetpack. fly speed. It's a jetpack. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I understand that entirely. Yeah. Well, it's not cheap. Well, there was, down, a, oh, there was a Warforged. There was a Warforged in our old campaign that we killed a flail snail. And used its its shell to make armor for him, and it was kind of like welded onto his frame. That's and cool. the um, spell sail armor, spell sail shell is actually what's used to make spell guard shield. So it gave him the properties of spell guard shield, nice. which really screwed with me because it gives you like resistance to magical damage and uh, advantage advantage on, on saving throws against spells and magical effects. Like like what Harry had. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty dope. <clears throat> All right. Um, I will. I will hopefully, if I ever have free time again, <laughs> try and get that list for you. Like, I'm, I, I have a few ideas. Like, uh, uh, hand crossbow. That's actually like a bolt that shoots out of your hand. Ah, that's what I was talking about. <laughs> um, that kind of thing. Um, maybe Even better, get, a, get an Iron Man thing on your hand. Yeah. yeah. So it's a repulsor blast. basically, for you, in, in, instead of kind of standardized magic items, and, and you you can use those. Like you'll have a head slot, you know, chest slot, arm slots, feet, etc. Hmm. So like you'll be able to customize. Attach and detach. And you'll be able to customize yourself. Uh, oh man. You know, I yeah, my mind's wondering now. Yeah, I can see some get, get a wand of magic missiles put into your hand, and then you can <laughs> fly around. <man. laughs> yeah, and just fly around and start shooting people. And they and they yeah. they fly like anime missiles, like. That'd be cool. Yeah, crazy. They all explode outward and converge. Yeah. <laughs> like Gundam anime <laughs> missiles. Anyway, because sorry. those were totally rational. <laughs> we are very easily distracted. All right. <clears throat> Do now? Um, I'm gonna. By the way, I do want to eat a shard candy while I'm walking. <laughs> okay. I'm just I'm just bored and I pick one out and eat it. All right. I'm saving mine. What do I roll? Uh, that would be a <clears throat> d10. D10, yeah. Is it the all my shard candy? Did I <laughs> slip that document that has shard candy stuff on it? I got ten of the damn things. I figured I'd eat one. Uh, shard. Candy. <laughs> okay. What so color is the shard candy? Uh, green. Okay. Green shards. Matching my Eldritch Blast. Sweet. Five. Five shards. Uh, uh, five. Five? Yeah. Out of percentile? You, I thought you said D10. I guess it could be. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. On percentile 50. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That is impressive. You know, it could be one through ten, I guess. That's be. fair enough. Are there ten options? Yeah. Then yeah, one so, through ten works better. You... Cannot speak for one minute. Instead, oh. what you're wanting to say comes out as smoky floating letters that dissipate in one round after speaking. <laughs> nice. I do that. I laugh. Like, ha ha ha. And, and <laughs> like the green joker. Ha ha ha. Juice. <laughs> this is wonderful. <laughs> yeah. But there's no sound. It's just the text. Yeah. And it just lasts for a And it's for shiggles, mostly. Uh, and it's pretty entertaining. So who, who's walking around me? Is Are we all walking together? Uh, yeah. You're in the base market, so there's a fair number of people around. So I'm going to say I'm with Stupid and have an end, end, end point. <laughs> 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 it, it stays for a little bit and then, and then fades. That's so great. See, I'm probably not with the, I was going to, going to uh, walk back with the gnome uh, the number agent back to HQ to kind of report in about what everything that's happened as well as the uh because i don't think we've reported in about or, or anyone had mentioned about the the threat like the, that we also received <clears throat> so the previous night oh the threat that, that i received yeah okay so you return and you see uh what's her name uh i got it so many peeps andrea hmm? Andrea. Andrea. 
This is the only other, only penumbra agent that I had written down. Tall, or, elegant elf. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, that or that might have been the one the one that uh was walking with uh. I really need to call it Maybe not. Maybe that's maybe that was a different one. Actually, I don't think about. It. I think that was the one that was in the the forest with me whenever I first met you guys. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, let's see. Do -do -do. Sorry, guys. Bartender. Uh, I know I wrote that down. Yeah. Andrea. There it is. Okay. It is Andrea. Thank you. So I didn't yeah. believe my notes. She is there. Okay. With uh, a couple of other people. She kind of gives a few commands and we wander out. Do you think it was a story? Hmm? How does the curious group you travel with? Well, they've we've managed to defuse now. How many? Three. The three bombs. Three. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I do believe it has been. Three, yes. Yeah. We've we've managed to find and defuse th uh, three madness bombs that uh, so that we're pending attack one on. Under the Coliseum, one under the sewers beneath the Babage Market, and then the, <clears throat> the other was obviously at the bazaar the first night. Okay. So. Excellent work. So, so we have our gnomish friend and the uh, and the ridiculous warlock to thank uh, for that. So they're the ones that uh, have been able to defuse them. So, and we also re received an, a note uh, directed to Crowley that. Uh, denoted a threat upon his life, which is unsurprising. <laughs> so, so, but so we believe that it did come from. Uh, oh shoot! What's his face? I wired on myself. Yeah. What was our big bad uh, name again? Uh, Sodus. Sodus Brain. Sodus Bainbringer. Yeah. So we. So well, who who we also initially suspect is. Is one of the the players behind? So a bit like behind the, 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 the plot of these bombs. <laughs> okay. The motivation is yet to be uh, de determined. Well, we have with this information, well, we have just put out that job. You want it? For sodas. We'll take it. So, so I seem to be the the one with the most foot in the door. We we are already established, and so have an invitation set to attend his party tomorrow night. I'll scout for an opportunity. Pays uh, out twenty five hundred white. Excellent. I assure you, he will be well guarded. Is that of course. Like problem? Most of the, uh, you know, he's the leader here, as distasteful as that may be. Yeah. We, uh, he's always trying to guards. He has basically all the guards. So if he's, a, if he's against you, be warned, the guards will not. It's not a problem. It's not sure fools can, uh, can barely stop a, uh, a dog from getting past him. <laughs> You'd be surprised. What they lack in skill, they gain in numbers. Indeed. Again, give me a few days. It'll be done. One way or another. Good. Guess what that bitch can go off to? <laughs> so, um, with that, also leave. Not with that. With that. Right. No, no, I got you. 
<laughs> she, uh, I'm trying to think of like. I mean, I feel like you could ask that question like literally like every time we we do something different. She has to ask. Like, where stuff. did he go? Pain. Uh, she hands you the writ. Okay. The writ of execution, like an oblivion or um, Morrowind, <laughs> that like gets you out of crimes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you killed that dude. Oh, right. Oh, no, that's fine. Okay, cool. We know. Yeah. Wait, no, that's Skyrim. It's the Morag Tong in, in Morrowind. So, uh, is there anything, like, there at the HQ that I can use to, like, I guess, like, study up on fire giants, specifically? Like, you'd want to go, uh, they don't have a lot of books. I mean, or just, like, anyone. Most of their books are on, like, poison. stealth and poison. Yeah, right, right. Um, um, or like trying to like maybe like talk with uh, anyone there. The University of Magi is going to be your best shot, for okay. that, which is kind of one of the stops anyway. Yeah. Um, but yes, that if you're wanting to research that sort of thing, yeah, the university. definitely would want to do that. Uh, not in the open. I'll probably dis- I'll probably end up disguising it's, myself when we go there. At this point, it's getting to be about. In the afternoon, like maybe 3 or 4 p.m. Um, there's not a lot of people out right now because of the trials happening. Yeah, it's hot. And it's hot? Well, like, you're all watching the trials. Yeah. Um, this is actually good for us if we're going to go yeah. find more bombs. So you have relatively... find a bomba. You have a, 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 an easier time navigating the streets based on the reduction in pedestrian. Members. But you do notice that there are um, occasionally like chunks of guards, not, not actually parts of guards, but groups, <laughs> groups of guards. <laughs> they exploded! No, I'm just kidding. Uh, that are keeping an eye on you. Well, no, that, the group. That, okay. okay. Yeah. So, Sometimes um, they will change direction to walk a little bit behind you and then go off in a different direction. Kind of don't worry, I get this treatment all the time. It's what you get for being you know, not human in a big city. Mm-hmm. Beep, boop, 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 beep. Or being <laughs> the wrong color. <laughs> <laughs> you can't speak common. No, <laughs> I'm going to throw them off. <laughs> so, I'm going to Everyone head... knows that art is people can speak at least common. <laughs> so, I'm going to head back to the Green Bazaar. Okay. And take a short rest to unattune to my charlatan's die and attune to the rapier. And then put them both in my packed weapon storage. Oh, it's not... Uh, it doesn't have any, like, magical enhancement outside of the, just being called the weapon. So it's, it's, like, not plus one. No, I get plus one from improved pack weapon. Okay. That's fine. I'm just saying. I, I, all, my ma- all my attacks are considered magical now. As a fifth level. Mm-hmm. That's pretty dope. Yeah. <clears throat> so I'm going to take a quick short rest and you know, kind of banish the sword into the ether. Because mm-hmm. I'm making it my packed weapon. And I'm going to see what happens when I pop it back out. Is it my saber? It's... Uh, oh, I see what you're saying. Um... Does it look a lot different now? It is... <clears throat> it's not a saber. Something different every time. <laughs> anymore. It is the rapier, but where originally... It was a very nicely con- constructed rapier that I had. Like, uh, the, like, like nice ivy design ivy handguard? Ivy design. Uh, maybe had a few like etchings of bells on it. Um, but when you summon it, after you attune to it, it's it doesn't have any of those designs on it anymore, and the sword, like like the blade itself, glows uh, like like your other one did. Nice, sweet. I get to up my damage die while I'm sweet. It's kind of a whole point of getting the rapier. Yeah. Cool. That's so, all. And I'm, I'm going to talk to him. Is this, okay? Is this phone okay with you? Are we good? Sure. Okay. Yeah. That's 
Also get a new another new feature that I'm gonna pop out in combat if that happens. That's all. You find there are several inns that have kitchen type spaces. Yeah. Um, the fact that you are an arcane chef gets you basically unlimited and free access to most kitchens in towers because of your renowned skill. Yeah. Um like Gordon Ramsay. Yeah. <laughs> so oh, uh, you rusty. can yes. donkey. <laughs> you can go ahead and make your eyes. Um, which takes a short rest. Yeah. So is everyone okay? Question: Is everyone going with him into that tavern for purposes of the short rest? No, I went back to the circus for that. I do want to. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I want to do your short do, rest. Do you, you want to post your your pies at the circus or in a tavern? Do you have a preference? Oh, preference. Okay. It'll probably be easier if you're all together. Yeah. Where where are the parties going? This is almost the place to cook. Um, Genevieve tries to corral Dan, but I've seen an outlet. He's, he's, he's just not happy. So he just doesn't get. God damn it. Actually, can I can I have that? Can what? I add like a like an adapt like a plug-in that I'm constantly Ar- looking for a plug-in? Like an arcane adapter. Yeah, I'm just constantly <laughs> looking for one. Well, you guys have been with these yet? You finally uh, find one that's not the right socket. <laughs> yeah, I, well, I just meditate or something. You get a like nuclear reactor. Certain upgrades that you'll be able to get later will have charges, so to speak, that will you know it'll like recharge over a short rest or a long rest or whatever. Sunlight. But for silk <laughs> so, no. Uh, what if I have like a, something that I would maybe just rub constantly to generate friction? Um, or just, just spill my fist all the time. Wow. Get like a shake weight. God wait. <laughs> I, like, I like that. <laughs> you know, I watch a lot of D and D streams. Like a lot. <laughs> And not one time <laughs> have I ever seen or heard of Mage Hand being used for that purpose. For charging yourself. <laughs> it's like, most, it's, most of them are more... It's a cantrip. Yeah. Just keep summoning it. Yeah. Most people are a bit more mature than us. That's not true. That's how they do the wizard string. Fair. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, I'm pretty sure when you first started this three years ago, you're like, "Wow, I never thought a D&D guru would think of this." And then we're just going with. Oh, you guys come up with some crazy stuff <laughs> that usually works. Yeah, six percent uh, of time works, hundred percent. Well, okay. <laughs> when it when it actually goes that route, it works. <laughs> yeah. A lot of times, though, you end up yeah. doing something else. Someone usually that, dies. that ruins that plan. Hi. Yeah, <laughs> that guy. <laughs> Gate earthquake. Bye. <laughs> Why do you run through? <laughs> oh yeah. Watch yeah, this. <laughs> you nothing to do at all. Uh, that was kind of like a hold my beer, watch this moment. Yeah, it's the, pretty bad when Inch was the voice of reason. Was like, no, don't do that. It's stupid. <laughs> it's a terrible idea. Yeah, you were in a meeting with very powerful people, and they were like, "Don't do that." And you're like, "I'm doing it." Anyway. I'm gonna do it. Okay. I'm cool. gonna do the thing. Hey, it all worked out. I didn't die. All right. You're at the, the bazaar. At this point, because of the trek back to that place, it's getting to be five five thirty ish. Do I do we see the do we see the box, the big glass box from Sven? Is the it big here? glass box was only for two hours. Well, I'm saying I asked back at the shop if, if they, no. Okay, I didn't know if Sven might have resummoned it by now. You I do not see. It. Okay, so they kept the powder. Once our once our short rest is done, so we don't have a few more bombs to, to search out. Anyone can heal if they wish. <laughs> Max up. Max up. Twenty four. Uh, yeah. Do well. 24. That's. I mean. I love it, and it just reset my mm-hmm. points. Yeah, I'm gonna stand behind you, and in the shadows, and away from everything. Uh, I'm just gonna um, uh, wait for me. <laughs> so we do have a few more bombs to search out. Uh, would anyone like to come with me to look for them, or? I would. Do. So I would probably hope that you are, f- found my way sure. back to them. Yeah. In <laughs> did not say that yet officially. Um, you're, still have... you're kind of like, do you travel a particular uh, stealthy way through the city? No. Like rooftops? You just walk no, I 
is it's, uh, easiest way to remain uh, undetected is inconspicuously in a crowd. Is to put cool. your hood up and, and just walk through the crowd like this. Yeah. Like Assassin's Creed. I mean, <laughs> yeah. I mean, my character is uh, like described as just like it's like close cut, brown like brown hair, not like not really any distinguishing mm. features, average height. That was the. You should really okay. find a group of priests to just walk around like this in. This is going back a ways, but the original Assassin's Creed where he plays out that year. Yeah. And, and you hide in the middle of, of, of the priests. priests. But all the priests are We're just in, in sacramental plain robes, and it, white robes, and you have like weapons all over Daggers and swords, <laughs> and you have daggers everywhere. And they're like, oh, cool, whatever. That's probably a priest. That's a war that, priest. That's probably a priest. <laughs> And I'm not going to question it. So. Fun game. No, anyway. Just the new ones. Anyway. I'm just going to hold the So, as far yeah. as the... I mean, you guys have... I mean, the city's wide open. You, you can Are there going to be any parades coming up or anything like that? Sure. No. Um, the trials don't really do the parade thing. Um, it's it's all contained within the so. Is so, there anywhere we can maybe, uh, I don't know, battle another squad or something? Well, we, we have bombs to look for. Do we have? <laughs> oh, yeah. That's true. There are. <laughs> there are two bombs there. Well, yeah, even better. Yeah, how late so is the day is there anywhere... at this point? It's got to, I mean, we were probably down there for it's, it's, a while. He said it's, it's like 5 o'clock. It's, it's pushing 5.30 okay. right now. Yeah. All right. So um, what's some... Populated areas because that's what um, we, well, he's I, scouted, I scouted them out earlier. Um, you have technically that, three bombs. Yes, three bombs. That we know of. We don't know if there's number seven out there. Yes. We're going to go off the of suspicion that so, this was six. I think we should split the And party. that was all two. <laughs> that's a terrible plan. I like um, it. That always works. No one's ever but, thought of that so before. So the places it that we had left were. were uh, no one has thought of it before. And so lived. whenever I first got them, were uh, highly populated taverns, which. At this point, we could probably assume it's going to be that uh, golden sphere. Uh, why would he? That, bo- why would he bomb a place where he's going to be? It's, uh, maybe he won't be there. So he, he can. He's probably got a, a way out if he doppel plan that. Um, I mean, if he's already under the effects of the madness, he's not going to be able to use an antidote. We also had uh, <laughs> the adamantine cover house. Which let's go there. Which I was gonna say, if it's five thirty, banks are clo- closes at five. We could break in. <laughs> yeah. Well, and maybe I, like the, I like the sound of that. This is not like I like the sound of breaking into the bank and robbing it. I got work. Banker's hours. All right, good. Now we got something going. Is it because everyone has the day at work day? Yep, the bank's closed. Yep. So, uh, do yeah, they, do America. They open, do they open before you can get uh, get there? Nope. Sure don't. Nope. You gotta go to work before they open. <laughs> so we don't have any leads. And then, but well, we have leads. Uh, and then the uh, the last place would be the university tower. Let's go. Tower, let's so. go to the co- the coffee house. Yeah, I, I like that idea. Okay. If we if we manage to accidentally steal some money, no one's going to notice. Until tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> then it's not a problem. <laughs> Yep. We're uh, still runners. We don't have roads. Can we get past that trace? Yeah, I guess. You do? You have that? Yeah, I do. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's, let's round the man team. <laughs> why Coffer would house. I? Why would I not? <laughs> you approach foolish. this building, and it appears to be. It's a dark. It's 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 an ebony building. Very very dark building. That building is black. Uh, yes. Um, the suit is black. Not. This bank is seemingly impenetrable mm, seemingly. as they have a sign up that states if you can successfully get into the vault, you can help yourself to its contents. Oh boy! Is oh, that so right? yeah. so generous. <laughs> there is also a nice count. <laughs> There's a count at the bottom of the sign. 337 thieves have tried. 335 thieves have died in the attempt. One was successful and one went insane. <laughs> I like those odds. I like those odds too. Those are good odds. tell me the odds. Those are really? good odds. One was successful. That's, all, success. I That's all I need to hear. Um, <laughs> there has been a success. Door is not well, locked. Yep, the other, 
that? Is this walk right in? Yeah, the other I was going to see if we could ask the bank manager if we could just go in and talk to and search the building. Well, it's, yeah, we're telling we're inspecting the vault for safety reasons. We're not going to lie. Guys, I got a jumpsuit right here that's you a can lie. vault inspector. Right just, here. Just <laughs> tell, <laughs> tell vault, him. Vault dweller. Yeah. Tell him we need to inspect the vault. Tell him that. Uh, <laughs> tell him they one know that. The There's been one suspicious one activity. But they'd have to inspect all the vaults. <laughs> No, we'll do it. They just give us the key. Right, I'm walking in the front Give us the key to the vault. Okay. We have to inspect it for While safety. While everyone else is arguing outside. Yes. And we'll show them the badge. Right. Like our... Like our uh, adventures uh, go back. What Act. do I... What is inside the... Hey. Like, is it a lobby? Mm. At the... Front... Uh, at the front desk, there oh. is a... He has... Bright oh, orange hair, like neon orange hair, uh, and is wearing a very nice, um, like a troll ball, fancy, fancy clothes, like troll ball. Like yeah, he's well to do. His hair is not wild, uh, but it is bright orange. Troll ball. <laughs> like when he gets out of bed in the morning, it's just <laughs> straight up. <laughs> <clears throat> Let me just say. I need to get a name for this gentleman because I did not do that yet. Should have expected to rob the bank. You <laughs> 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 knew what this was. I didn't expect to be on your side on this one. <clears throat> but then I remembered I'm a charlatan. I don't know. I need to play a character like more. Takes a lot of takes a lot of money to be a professional chef. Good day to you. Yes. Good day to you as well. Did the, anybody else come in with me or I go in my yeah. I, came, I came with you. I okay. came with you. We are with a group, with a group known as Steen Ronuts. Oh, yes. Start doing games. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we have been... <laughs> I'll say... <laughs> Do you have items you need to retrieve from the vault? Uh, not currently, but that maybe it's something we need to... In a few minutes. We'll let you know. So we have been <laughs> investigating um, a disreputable member of society leaving bombs within the city. What? Yes. Uh, and I'm going to take out the casings that I've retrieved along the way. They look like this. They have two cylinders, one filled with, filled with UTEC. When you... Oh, you just take out... I take out the bomb parts, like okay. the casings, not, not, not the bombs. Okay, okay, I don't got have it. those. Got it. <laughs> we gave those to the little gnome man to go explode no, the No, I mean, desert. like, you don't take out the powder stuff. Oh, God, no. You just take out... Okay, okay. <laughs> but, so it could be a good distraction. Von, von cylinder is usually filled with Yotek. Von is filled with a type of powder. With, with, yes. Kind of Unstable Otek. Great. Unstable Technos, excuse me. Okay, and then have to do with, with me and the bank. we've been looking into targets around the city, and so far we've been collect on all of them. The okay. golden, the golden sphere, Crowley's Dream Bazaar, the Colosseum, anywhere mm -hmm. where there are large groups of people, or that will have the maximum amount of effect. We think that your that the Adamantium Coffer House has been targeted. If we would like to look around, I have experience diffusing these bombs, and I can take care of it, if I can find it. If it's not here, we will leave. And you can stay with us the whole time to make sure we're not robbing you blind. Well, I assure you that they didn't get Are you sure there was a sign outside that you've had at least two people who have made it into the vault? Well, no, technically only one. 
You said one went insane, I assume he went to a vault and got Yeah, I'm pretty insane. sure the insane person can also be in bombs. Same. Yeah, so... Anything you should have... The successful one was... Uh, 200 years ago. The plan the long time. Can, well, can I see if I remember <laughs> who that might have been? Because I think I know who it was. <laughs> Uh, that would be a 13. Is it Psy? No. 200 years ago. Oh, 200, okay. Psy was good, too. He did But anyway, um... So, here's the no, thing, though. They, I think, well, not particularly. I, I assume there's some sort of teleportation magic involved between all the drop no. sites. No, no, no. Why don't you show us how your bank works? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> First, I'm just going to read this because, you know, it's easier that way. First, there's a magical key that one must be attuned to. It opens a hatch and it goes down. The key changes and must be used every fourth ladder run as a series of holes aligned in the crawl space fire out purple worm poison tipped darts. Oh, balls. Which is, I believe, 12. That's 14. It's like 14 to 6 poison yeah. tipped darts. At the bottom of the 20 foot or the 20 rung ladder, there is a platform that leads to a zone constructed of La Vic, making magical hiding impossible. Oh! And when he says La Vic, I'll say, oh, yeah, that is part of the bomb. Nice. La Vic powder. There, uh, there are ceiling mounted repeating crossbows that shoot force bolts that deal force damage. Because nothing's really force damage. <laughs> Ghosts should be. Well, they're not immune to magic, though. That's true. Um, it fires very quickly, firing five rounds, five times a round. That is impressive. Um, there is a voice command that can shut down the crossroads, but it must be a specific code that changes very frequently, spoken by the person to the key. I don't think we're breaking in. Uh, next is the vault door the itself. Pen, whatever it is. The That's vault walls and door are magically strengthened and adamantine. It's outside of the lobby space. So mm -hmm. I would, uh, I would understand that your cards are adamantine uh, coffee house. The vault has, uh, the vault door has seven locks that reset every seven rounds. So you must successfully pick each lock and it. Lock it. It's very difficult. When's the last time you checked this vault? To give you. Uh, we check it every day. Um, Sorry about that. The DC to pick each lock is progressive, I'm it's, guessing. No, it's 35. Oh, balls. That's, that's higher than an okay. spell. Nope. <laughs> yeah. It is absurd. Can you get, uh. Not, so not doesn't work on these. Yeah, so we're going to need to get, uh, me some um, the okay. gloves of thievery. Any failure results in the, in the instruction of, of any pick that's within its lock. In the firing of a dart that deals 46 force damage. So, so maybe the bomb's not in the vault. Uh, it could be in the lobby. It could be in the lobby. It could be where we're at. Very, right very few. Uh, like, you know, one out of 300, 337 people have actually been able to get in. Uh, they, they took some. They didn't take everything. Okay, two questions. Yes. First off, is this lobby ever crowded? Do you ever have a bunch of people all in here at once? Is there like a regular time of day where there's a lot of people here to deposit or pick up money? Yeah. Okay, and is I know you have sites all around the city this is for, for lock boxes to deposit into. Are any of those you know, more popular than the others to right now during the festival? The lock boxes that are like used by vendors? Yes. Uh, all coins deposited into those are uh, sent directly into our vault. I understand. But are the sites, the actual sites where they are located, are any of the boxes more popular than the others? Uh, okay. it, it just depends on the time of day and who's buying what. Alright. And what that merchant is selling. 
And then you get a small clown to the box. Don't. <laughs> no, hold on. So, to your request, he can hear us. First off, he doesn't care. <laughs> He doesn't care if anyone tries to rob the place at all. It doesn't sound like it's possible. No, you're welcome to try. <laughs> you he can will, certainly he will, try. He will even open the top lash for you. <laughs> oh, no. uh, seriously, he will. You're a gentleman. And you'll die. <laughs> <laughs> That's like the two of horrors on crack. Um, yeah. No. 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 Okay. All right. So what happens to, to things that are put into the lockbox that are not Draka? Um, they also go into the vault. So everything goes into the vault. But I take it there's not a way back through the lockbox. Not unless they report here to retrieve their belongings. That is a plan. (laughs) We have a tiny robot (laughs) store. Oh my god. (laughs) That's actually a good plan. <laughs> Let's deactivate him, or like make him give, like give him a sleep mode. <laughs> the pause him. He wakes up, <laughs> pulls a bender, <laughs> and then the draw. We'll, we'll do this a little later. Um, so to try that. first off, can I look around your lobby? Do you mind if I Oops, if we so search, if we search around, see if there's you actually a... see a few of those like ceiling mounted repeating crossbows. They just kind of rotate. <laughs> Around. Now, do you scan everything when it goes into the vault? How would you like, scan it? We like look at it or detect, it? <laughs> detect magic or you know like we do. Uh, that's an interesting question. Identify it. Um, we do have a a group of magic users that um, identify items before they are put in the vault, just so that we don't store anything that is inherently evil or violent or you know. I mean, weapons notwithstanding. I have a plan for this. We'll discuss it later. Like the, All right. the you know, we we wouldn't store things like dangerous things would go to Sven's coffee shop because he protects them better than me. Okay. All right. So. Which is safe. And do you all have like safe deposit boxes or something to that effect? Like I guess. Yes. Are they also in the vault? Mm-hmm. Are they in the vault too? The safe deposit boxes. Some of the the larger slash more expensive ones are yes. We have okay. we have a handful that are not in the vault because it's kind of a chore to get into the vault. I can tell. All right, so yeah. I'm gonna look around, see if I can find a bomb in here. If not, we'll be good. This is just checking an item off the list. Can you repeat that? Uh, He's just looking around the, like, the lobby to see if there's a bomb. <laughs> yeah, we're going to look around the lobby okay, to see yes. if there's a bomb. I'm sorry. If not, we're just going to check out. Yes, yes, please do. All right, so we're going to... Uh, who's got a be- the better investigation skill? Because I will help you. I'm going to spy kind of flies around. I, I have a, an incredible passive investigation. I have a, I have a seven. <laughs> In case you haven't heard. All right, I will assist you. <laughs> <laughs> you advantage. All right, I'm going to so investigate. that's for casually you noticing spot, things. Spot every we'll have advantage. Nice. Yes. Nice. Yeah, I'm going to investigate, and he's going to help me. Oh, so. Okay. So. Oh. Well, he can help you, and you have advantage. Yeah, yeah that's what and I'm saying. you can search independently. Search me. One, uh, 16. <laughs> I you got me. I only rolled a 13. That's okay. I only got the 15. There are... Uh, 15. Um, the lobby and the adjacent space where the... Uh, where the, <gasps> the little personal lock boxes are is meticulously clean. Um, there are no errant crates stacked around. Specifically because of the chance that something nefarious can be snuck into them or something like that. So um, there's nothing that is out in the open. <clears throat> um, there are in the sort of lobby lockbox area, there's about 300 boxes. And they, they vary in size. Some are very small, like to the point of, you just store a handful of gold, or uh, 
dropping in them. Um, some are about the size of a large chest, where you can hold any number of things, in them, depending upon what you want to store there. So there's nothing in this this room that is striking out as a lead lined box containing a bomb. No, nothing, nothing blatantly stands out. Nothing that says bomb. On it. Yeah. Um, there are no bombs yeah. here. Mm-hmm. All right. So I'm gonna talk to the attendant again. So can you give us? Is, did, I, am, I am Bedrick, by the way. Bedrick, thank you. I am Crow. Is he like a tank manager? You give me your real name. <laughs> Crowley is the name of everyone in my family. Or von Lichtenstein. <laughs> what an excellent film. That was. Uh, what was your question? And he, he I pull out my lad. map of the city. Mm-hmm. I'm assuming I have a city map from somewhere. You can. I mean, it's pretty easy to acquire one. Yeah. yeah. Especially no, during the trials, yeah. they have. I think you guys did get one. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. so in Paul, Madison, name can you point out? Patrick, B-E-D-R-I-C. Oh, okay. Um, can you point out on this map where your your best lock boxes are, like uh, the locations where they are most frequently used? That would be the beige market. Beige market. Mm-hmm. That's where, like, right now we have uh, most of our lock boxes rented out for the purposes of the vendors here. During the trials. And any in other any other districts that are widely used, like you know, the taverns or um, some some of the taverns have them as well. Like their own private ones or like a communal lockbox? Um Well, for example, the sexy badger uh, coin doesn't come here. They have their own lockbox because nobody fucks with the sexy badger. We we are aware. Because uh, that's just stupid. Um, only the, would you say only someone crazy would fuck with a sexy badger? Yeah. We need to go to the sexy badger. I would say that that mm. is certainly which, which one. How many oh, sexy badgers is. are in the city? Here, uh, it's a pretty good sized city, so there's at least two. Maybe three. Let's say you roll a d4. Re-ro- re-roll a one. I'm cool with that. Three. There we go. For a big one, one's bigger than the other ones. In the fancier uh, part of the city is the larger, nicer one. Let's go there. Um, but they Anywhere have... Though there's going to be a lot of people. Yeah. That seems to be the best bet. Oh. That's me. <laughs> No worries. Um, yeah, so that. I mean, if you're wanting population, especially of the uh, wealthier sort, then that's, that's where you want to go. Mm. Yeah, let's go there next. And on the way, I will discuss with you my plan to rob the bank. We got some ideas. Don't, don't discuss it in front of me. Why? Because I'm a paladin, son. I can't let you do that. Uh, which god do you worship? <laughs> I'm, I'm opposed to all evil. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's, it's not, not evil. evil. Well, who Robert says, Bank, Robert who, Bank's evil? Is who says it? Say the bank is evil for holding all of that money from the people. I'm yes, exactly. <laughs> Actually, it's holding all the money for the people. Yeah. Oh. The, yes, we, we are the people. Though. <laughs> the we people. only technically speaking. we only rob the rich people in the vault and then give all of the money to the poor people in the city. Yeah. Well, such as myself. Again, yeah. you're welcome to try. <laughs> I'm not like, doing that. They they're cool with that. They're cool with you trying. We should wait to a higher level. <laughs> I've, got, I've got a plan. Because maybe we're the Yeah. We should oceans thirteen this shit. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna <laughs> oceans thirteen. Yeah. One of the oceans. 11, 12, 13. Eight. No, yeah. eight's gonna suck. <clears throat> yeah, probably be right. I'll watch it. Anyway. Whatever. So yeah, let's let's go yeah. to. Uh... Oh, see, it looks terrible. Yeah. <laughs> Let's head over to the sexy badger in the rich part of town. Okay. <clears throat> We're going to find out that this is where Kane's been going to deliver his reports. 
king if it was here. Find that friggin' right. gnome. Yeah. Actually. Alright, so we get a big box. No, no, we don't need the big box. We just sneak him in, so one of the lock boxes, it goes straight to the box. Oh, no, no, we're going to do that. <laughs> we, we get a big box, <laughs> we fill it full of lead. <laughs> Brace is better. The heavier, the better. We got to move that way. We got to leave enough room for Clank to get in. Come and then on. we're going to sneak into the lockbox and he's going to fill the, manager. the thing up huh? and get in the, the crate and then come back out. Manager. I feel like this is going to get me killed. And then we'll, oh, yeah. we'll <laughs> withdraw the crate. How about when you guys shrink down and go into the lockbox? Like they how, they, wait, how long does your enchantment last when you shrink? Until I do it. Until I go back. Is that true, Gerald? Right. Or is it just yeah. like the large reduced spell? No, it, it, it's... Lasts it's, until dispelled? Yeah. Well, it's not really like a dispellable thing. He can increase and decrease his size as an action. As a part of the artifice thing. You get lead bricks um, painted where, gold. Where, where the drawback <laughs> the comes is... He goes so don't health. use actual gold anymore. So use dragon scales. So we'll make some fake dragon scales. And yeah. then we'll just put them in uh, the box. Have we been doing that? Yeah. They're not going to look I that hard at them. No gold. Yeah. <laughs> put the box in the box. <laughs> That's what I was saying. I was so like, man, we got to do something else. He gets in the bottom and pours drop all over the top of them when we withdraw the crate the next day. Like, that can go. Yeah. I think I'm going to have a hundred wide drop out. So... That's it's all good. Anyway, uh, so the the nice sexy badger um, for gravity. We'll just have you guys walk over there. And at this point, it's maybe because uh, you spent some time looking at the, the inside of the bank uh, or the coffer house. Oh, do we do we pass any vendors along the way? There's some, yeah. Food, right. food vendors and I meant like weapons vendors. Just like uh, standard, not Sven's. Yeah, yeah. Right, like I, need a to, yeah. No, I need to stop <clears throat> by Fletcher. Oh, okay, yeah. It's it's a city, so you can totally find a place. Um, can you turn to equipment real quick, Will? Yeah. We need crossbow bolts or something? No, no, arrows. Arrows. I have a plan. Okay. There's a thing. I want to do a thing. Arrows are pretty cheap. It's I like, know, I can't remember how much like, they are. It's like one gold for 20. Too big Arrows are twenty for one gold. Yeah. yeah. All right, so I'm yes. going to buy. I remembered. <laughs> and would, how, would you say like a quiver is like five gold? They'll they'll throw in the quiver. All right, I'm going to buy forty arrows. Okay. And to get the quiver, I'll just put it in the back. Cool. Improved pack weapon. I can make a bow now. Neat. Very neat. That 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 doesn't that doesn't preclude my sword. It just in place of the sword, it comes out as a bow, and I can, and then pff, sword. That's pretty good. I like that. Okay. Give me some range options. So you make your way into the second battery. At this point, it's pushing after the trip to the copper house and yeah. Fletcher. Uh, I'd say it's pushing about seven. So we're getting on peak the fifth dinner day. Rush. Getting peaked in a rush. Um, they don't like the sexy badger. Does have decent food, but it's not. That's not why people come. That's not why you go to sexy badger <laughs> at all. Different reasons, but you can eat and drink there. They do have a, a bar type space. I'm gonna find the most clothed person I can find. That would be the matron. Yeah, I'm gonna find the matron. Uh, it's a corgan. Okay. Uh, she seems to be older, but not, I mean, she's still... Her scale's a little she's flaky. She's very beautiful individual, but, like, she has just the slightest hint of, like, the, like, what's that called? Crow's, Crow's feet. feet. Crow's feet. Stuff like that. Like, she's noticeably Lap older, lines. but she's still super hot. Greetings. Hello. Uh, we are from Steam on Us, and I did the thing again. Uh-huh. And she kind of nods the game. I've seen you in here before. I don't. Um, I, by the way, without any sort of like checks or anything, you do notice that Andrea is sitting at one of the tables. The, the chick that was with me. Yeah. Ah, you were interrogated. The so, first time. So, <laughs> look at her <I'm> like. <clears throat> so, as I'm sure you're aware. <laughs> well, girl. <laughs> we've been going around town diffusing explosives that would drive everyone insane and kill magic. Try not to talk about Maybe that's a bad point. Cause overt panic. 
That's why I came to you and didn't just start shouting just at the door. Oh, but I appreciate that. I'm Marissa, by the way. Hello, Marissa. I'm Carly. So, Rude. we <laughs> are concerned that whoever's planting these, and we know who it is, I just don't want to say it. Um, okay. But I'm sure you know as well from Kane's reports. Uh, you don't know that I'm giving reports to anybody. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we do. That's, that's meta knowledge. We, <laughs> you disappear for hours at a yeah, time. You yeah, you disappear. You come Superman. back with random people. That, that's just something I put together. We're selling drugs. Not so much, but continue. We believe this person to be insane. Who is she kidding? And only someone insane would target <laughs> the sexy badger. We're concerned that they may have left one of these bombs here. We'd like to look around. I have experience just diffusing these devices. I think you're supposed to yell bomb in a bar. I'm not yelling, okay. I'm whispering. Okay. Uh, she, she does the use can't to Kane. This food crazy? It's, it's, that's true. Mostly. It's a little. Mostly, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'll start doing this. I'll start doing this. Yeah, okay. <laughs> 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 and she's, she's not solemnly. She died in that hand. <laughs> Maybe we'll check the storehouse then. Okay. If it's going to be anywhere, we'd like to be there. Any event that's going to be populated, they've targeted the circus, they've targeted the Coliseum, and they've targeted the sewers. Frequently. Are they targeting the sewers? So, dirty people living in the sewers. Well, when you target the sewers, the gas comes out to the grates. Oh, that makes sense. And up in the various houses. Exactly. Like. How would you like it if you were sitting on the toilet and get a burst of gas in the butt? <laughs> Gross. <laughs> <laughs> especially Pictures that image! Especially gas that makes you go. Kingsman crazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not good. So, let, so do you give us permission to search around without getting shot from various different locations? Of course. Thank you. She kind of nods. And, uh, you don't really notice anything. Do a magnifying glass. Yeah. Just gives just like like somebody. Sherlock Holmes. Thing. I'm guessing there are about three or four crossbows that we just put down. Do my next class, detective. You don't know. That's what I'm guessing. King does, but you don't know. <laughs> there were a handful that were ready to, ready to get you. Oh, you point crossbows at all your patrons? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just here for a drink. It's business. You don't see anybody with a crossbow. I'm here for a drink and some boobs, man. That's it. What are you doing to me? You don't boobs see anybody. Alright, so we're going to look around. I'll be assisting him again. Okay. Come on! Come on, Birdman. What you got? You got Quetzal. Quetzal's uh, pretzels. Uh, 19. Is that a 1 over there? That's no, a, four. a 4. Okay. 19. 19. 1 was last time. 19. Yeah. Anybody else doing a uh, helping search? Doing the search? Yeah, I'll do the search. And wait. Investigations. Investigation. Okay. Yeah. It was, uh, 21. Ooh. 21's good. Nah. You have a plus 0, man. I have a plus 1. And all the stats I'm not proficient in. Oh. So 10! I do. It's right next to it. Oh. Jack of all trades? I think it's something to do with my class, the local answer. Everything I'm not proficient in, I plus one in. Is it plus one or is it half proficiency? It might be proficiency, right. but half yeah. proficiency. So what was yours? 10. 10. Got it. I helped um, him. I just like looked. Nope. 19. No bombs. 21. Did you search and just kind of standing by? I might as well. It's always shitty, but you never know. Yeah, it's just like that. <laughs> <laughs> no bueno. Okay. Yeah. There it's is. Just, yeah. No bueno. You just yell That's it. it. No bueno. Yeah. <laughs> there is. <laughs> I do not. Definitely no explosives yeah. here. Like, I do not see it at the bar, guys. <laughs> yeah. Another round. You can just chill at the bar. Um, There'll so be you, some lovely ladies coming up to you. So you'll be in the search. There are... Uh, and lovely man. Does it make you feel powerful? Okay. Okay. This <laughs> it's is not, it's not unholy. It's, it's legit. It's not evil. <laughs> sexy you're, badger. You're supposed to rob them banks, but that's okay. The sexy yeah. badger has a, a very high, um, has a very known high 
high quality of its staff. Um, the seedier places, it's not as stringent per se, <laughs> but it, like it's still good, it's still decent at least. Um, not like typical seeding towers. So but for selling drugs, that's one thing, drugs. but just prostitution, it's legit business. Uh, they are, it's sort of like companions in Firefly, where they're like, governmentally legal. Yeah. yeah. Uh, because that's the best way to gather information. Not a hard man. The yeah. best. It just is. Except she was a secret Nazi, so. <laughs> um, there are a variety of races that are there. Um, uh, even a handful of Dragonborn. So... Theoretically, you could partake. Bump scale. If you wished to. <laughs> yeah, bump scales. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you search for about thirty minutes uh, through the store. The damn with its knocking the ones. In the basement is where a lot of the storage is. Um, you also see a couple Some rough of uh, <laughs> uh, stores of like. They don't have sex. I don't know what's and called. Poisons and the like. <laughs> You see that they have bottles of Death Dancer Ooh, oh down no. here. No, no, no. Um, like that is a bottle of bad decisions. Yes. <laughs> yes Every, everyone's probably tried it once or twice and uh, before. So and, last and, time and I had that, I wound up naked on top of a tent. <laughs> True story, bro. I can drink them, right? I don't do anything to me. You're immune you to things. Can't really eat or drink. Yes, it is. You don't have a mouth. So you you're basically bendering it up. I just throw it on myself. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good. Welcome to my home. I am human. Yeah. <laughs> Let me charge up real quick. <laughs> Game. Um, you were Reminds familiar with. Cat with videos. I'm a human. Dirty, dirty, dirty. You're familiar with how most things are stored in Sexy Patrick Tavern. Mm. I mean, yeah. um, and you find tucked away like the first thing you notice is that a couple of things do do I say yay because we found one or mm. buzz because um, we found one there is a <laughs> stuffed behind several other crates of various bottles of alcohol and some dried meat and that sort of thing A relatively unassuming looking box mm -hmm. that um, it just looks to be a wooden crate. But when you go to pick it up with your, what, what's your strength? Yeah. Ten. Yeah. So you <laughs> have average really strength. Like, yeah. You're not weak. You're stronger than me. But um, you go to, to lift it and it's like, oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> Call it it's like, dragon it's heavy. Uh, God is a dragonborn. I'm, a, I'm actually. Oh, Harriet. I'm actually uh, going to go and get uh, the matron. And that's, okay. that's actually who I'm going to go and get to. Uh, and it's like, can you tell me what this is? Uh, she, she follows you down there. Most, mostly because I don't want to uh, point out something that may be guild related to everyone, everyone else see. as well. <laughs> that's fair. I am unfamiliar with it. It's not anything of uh, I've ever seen it. And I go. I don't know. I'm who also put it down here. But doing well, right? Yeah. And it's it's, uh, it's, it's, it's nothing for number. Yeah, right. I'll go ahead and say it's like this is probably what we're looking for. You said that loud. No, I like, still like to her, and then I'll be. Okay. And then I'll be like, let me get Crowley. Can you can you find the, uh, our gnomish friend? He's, yeah. <laughs> Your hand. Currently in this upstairs. Find her bitch. Uh, she she goes out and goes up and he, uh, Harriet moves to grab the box. No, let me defuse it here. Oh, okay, fair enough. Well then, the the, the no guy. Uh, very perturbed. 
steps down, and he's he's not happy right now. His hair is a little bit yellow, um, and like his his normally very well kept um, armor is like not it's like buttoned bare. right. You know what I mean? Hmm. So, like it was already like, here, huh? Like he's he's misbuttoned it. <laughs> Did we disturb you? Yes. <laughs> Found a NASA bomb. Here. <laughs> I point down. Right here. Okay. And I can sold the matron. Only someone crazy would target the sexy badger. Alright, fine. Uh, Let's get the box open, get it diffused. Do you think we should evacuate the people? It won't matter if we screw it up. We're all dead anyway, you're right. We're all dead anyway. Better to not create mass. <laughs> All right, let's get the box open. I'll defuse it. Use your help. Okay. It's good practice. My, my, my better than him at this, apparently. No, it's just. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's good. He doesn't. He's a, he's just a tinkerer. He could pick the lock. What what did you roll? Oh, okay. He's getting air horn for it. They do that on the C team. <laughs> Which is great. Yeah, uh, with this seems to be the same kind of lock on other lock boxes, and you become more familiar with it. A little more, so yeah. just kind of click. It's just easy. Real like, quick. yep, it's the same one. Good luck. Mm-hmm. And then also, uh, right after I, f- I finish with that, I want to try to go upstairs and essentially just start like scanning like the crowd, like just like okay. keeping an eye, on, keeping an eye on everything, to see if I can notice anything out of place. So you. My once again must ask, is, how the hell I became the one to defuse these things? It's your proficient in tinkerer's tools. I know this. He is. I as robot. Beep boop boop beep. <laughs> <laughs> Play dumb. Hey, what what is your tinkerer's check bonus? Uh, it's dexterity plus proficiency, right? Yes. Four. No, our proficiency bonus went up by one. I just level. Oh level right. So I am higher than you right now. Yep. So it would normally be the same. Yes. Okay. Cool. cool. Yeah. All right. Let's do this. Yeah, I've got a plus Not five. He's got a plus four. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna start out just as I did. Damn it! <laughs> lucky dice. No. I, I didn't even look at it. Just, we didn't just even look at it. Throw dice everywhere. Rude. All right, as I had before, I'm gonna start by identifying the the obvious triggers, the ones that will go off if I cut those wires. Okay. Wow, that's really bad. Okay. Uh, luck. Thank you. What do I okay. roll? Um, you add a d6, I believe. It's still a d6. Yeah, d6. Still not good. 13. Better than what you have. Okay. You believe that you have isolated the correct wires. The correct wires. Alright, so. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're going to get this, guys! So, just to be clear, I have not cut anything yet. All I've done is put those little we'll ties ahead. on. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and queue up the second half of Freebird. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Get ready for that church scene. Mark off one of points. <laughs> you know what? I, I... Yes! There you go, Nat 20. Yes! Bow, 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 bow. Bow, 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 bow. <laughs> Nat 20. Natty 20. On the Mercer die. What were you doing with that? That was starting to diffuse it. Okay, I Because you said it's like three checks you, every time. You go to begin cutting wires, and you actually catch a few. That I missed before. That you missed before. <laughs> oh. Well, this is bad. Maybe this not. Is bad. Maybe not I am one. like pouring sweat yeah. now. <laughs> it's like, I missed a few oh. wires. This is bad. Maybe not that one. Okay. <laughs> Let's see what else. See what you got. Last check, right? There's three checks last time, so... Well, because you were very successful. Ah, that's time. right. If you only get two ones, we're good. Why'd you have to say something? Luck. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> you can get two ones, we're you good. Can, you can do that, yeah. You also have a plot point. Ooh! 16. Oh, 
Yeah. With luck. Sixty. I used that pop last okay. time. I didn't believe it. Um, you cut a wire. And, and it starts ticking, doesn't start it? Start to hear ticking. Great. This is wonderful. <laughs> I need to change dice because y'all are both going to fucking jail. <laughs> Dice gel. <laughs> I found some really good prints of dice gels. Like I was thinking about the Steven community thing because they're really. I do, I do, some of them are really I good. Dice. I want one. Yeah, they're really good. All right. Yes. <laughs> I, I swear I thought that was two, like a pocket of four. I was like, oh, <laughs> yeah, I heard that. Yeah. Uh, that is twenty-three. Oh, nice. Okay. <laughs> This one is the one. Last check. We have to have three successes before three failures. How we many have, how many failures do I have? have? Two successes and two failures. Oh, good <laughs> God! So I just want you to be aware, and you can preemptively uh, add some luck here if you what's, want. Yeah, to. I'm gonna. What's can I give him a luck for an extra roll? Also. Now I've got a plot point for that. You have a plot point. Uh, How far can I fly away before you? <laughs> you're, <laughs> you're dead. Not far enough. <laughs> you're just up there drinking. You're fine. You're good. Oh, so if you have away. a plot point, we'll, we'll see what happens. Oh, man. Yes. Yes. 24. Natural 19. You exhale. It's kind of like... Very unsteady. <laughs> like, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. I start crying. Very, very shaky uh, kind of stress. But you successfully Alright, I'm going to take out the U Tech and hand it off to our gnome friend. By the way, when you open the chest, um, you do hear a little bit of a commotion up there. <laughs> Because, like, some of the lights go out and stuff. <laughs> and other magic cease to function? Uh, there's not really magic that does that sort of thing, but... Yes, there is. Alter self. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> uh. <laughs> She's an old crone. Wow, what the... <laughs> Whoa, oh. He just shrank by four inches. I didn't pay this much. <laughs> I wasn't that much. <laughs> That's a very funny use for alter self. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> like, need to write. To be fair, stuff. it lasts an hour. <laughs> That's yeah. enough time for most prostitutes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. And with that, we're going to go off the train. You're welcome, Internet. That's, that's delightful. Um, what was the number on this bomb? Yeah, that's what, that was my next question. Oh, we'll do that real quick. Um, this one was four. So, so far we've discovered six, three, two, and four. Oh, yes. So, and I wish we had detect, so we just need number detect item or something. Like, right. Detect also, um, what, yeah. what was the matron's name? Five. 